Sphinx Cat vs. Devon Rex Cat What are the differences between the two cat breeds? The Sphinx typically weighs 6 to 12 pounds while the Devon Rex weighs 5 to 10 pounds. The Sphinx is a medium-sized cat with a striking appearance, identified by her hairless, wrinkled skin and large ears. She has a sleek, muscular body that is dense and heavy for her size. Although the Sphinx appears to be completely bald at first glance, closer inspection will often reveal a very fine, short coat of fuzz that gives the skin the feel of fine suede. It's the hairlessness that primarily marks a Sphinx, with color and pattern lying in the pigmentation patterns of the skin which are clearly visible on the skin of the Sphinx cat. All skin patterns and colors are acceptable. An adult Devon Rex is a medium-sized cat, although the head looks large and the chest is broad. The males tend to have medium boning, while the females may have lighter boning, so some males are significantly larger than females. The first impression of a Devon Rex cat is of an impish face and a crinkly coat. The cheeks are wide, the eyes and ears are very large, and set low on the head. The soft and curly coat on the Devon Rex is also unusual. Many Devons have a lack of fur in some areas, especially those areas where she can lick herself. The coat is fragile and even grooming can cause the fur to break off completely. Devons also generally have broken whiskers because the whiskers are also fragile. The Devon Rex cat has the characteristic Rex Marcel wave, and the fur forms ripples and waves, particularly on the back. The whiskers and eyebrows also curl. The Devon Rex cat breed can be any coat color or pattern. It's a good thing that these two adorable breeds, the Sphinx and Devon Rex love people, attention because they draw it wherever they go. They are demanding human attention and will do anything for a laugh. When it comes to their personality, the Sphinx loves attention because he draws it wherever he goes. He is demanding human attention and will do anything for a laugh. Look at me. Is his catchphrase. That makes him easy to handle by veterinarians or anyone else, and it's not unusual for a Sphinx to be a therapy cat since he is so fond of meeting people. When he is not receiving the attention of his adoring fans, the curious and energetic Sphinx is exploring his surroundings, climbing his cat tree or otherwise seeking high places, chasing a bug, or just generally getting into mischief. He is extremely fond of teaser toys and puzzles toys that challenge his athleticism and brains. Devon's favorite perch is right at head level, on the shoulder of his favorite person. He takes a lively interest in everything that is going on and refuses to be left out of any activity. Count on him to stay as close to you as possible, occasionally communicating his opinions in a quiet voice. He loves people and welcomes the attention of friends and family alike. This is a smart cat with a moderate activity level. He's not in constant motion, but he does like to learn tricks and play fetch. Puzzle toys and interactive toys are a delight to his inventive brain and will help to keep him occupied while you are out earning money to buy more of them. Both pedigreed cats and mixed breed cats have varying incidences of health problems that may be genetic in nature. The Sphinx cat breed is prone to skin problems including the development of rashes and fungal infections. Care must be taken to protect the Sphinx cat from sunburn. As with all cats, Sphinx cats benefit from protection against disease through vaccination and need annual veterinary health checks. Because of the nature of its coat, the Devon Rex cat can be prone to yeast infections of the skin that can cause ear problems, greasy deposits on the skin, and itching. Rexes can also be prone to baldness, a disorder known as hypotrichosis. Because of the back crossing needed to establish the breed's initial gene pool, there have in the past been genetic spasticity problems associated with the breed, known as Devon Rex myopathy, but careful breeding has all but eliminated this now. Every cat is unique and each has its own particular likes, dislikes, and needs when it comes to food. However, cats are carnivores. Sphinx and Devon Rex cat must obtain 41 different and specific nutrients from their food. The proportion of these nutrients will vary depending on age, lifestyle, and overall health, so it's not surprising that a growing, energetic kitten needs a different balance of nutrients in her diet than a less active senior cat. Other considerations to bear in mind are feeding the right quantity of food to maintain ideal body condition in accordance with feeding guidelines and catering to individual preference regarding wet or dry food recipes. Hello! This video is sponsored by BMix Pets. Are you looking for high quality cat collars at an affordable cost? Check out bmixpets.com. Use coupon code KITTENLIFE to get 20% off. Are they hypoallergenic? The Sphinx is not considered hypoallergenic because her skin still produces normal amounts of allergy-causing dander. The Devon Rex is a breed of cat with a curly, very soft short coat similar to that of the Cornish Rex. They are often thought of as one of the most hypoallergenic cats available because of their type of coat. However, they are technically not hypoallergenic. Despite his bald body, a Sphinx requires at least as much grooming as cats with fur and maybe even more. 
Their skin must be kept moisturized with a gentle, scent-free lotion or oil, and they need weekly baths so as not to leave greasy spots on your furniture and clothing. Use a gentle baby shampoo or moisturizing shampoo and rinse thoroughly, especially between the folds of the wrinkles. If you begin bathing your Sphinx kitten while he is young, he will learn to accept and sometimes even enjoy baths. Baby wipes will help to keep him clean between baths. Devon's wavy coat is easy to maintain. Groom gently so you don't break the delicate hairs. In many cases, brushing your hand over the coat is all it needs. The best thing about a Devon Rex coat is that it doesn't shed much, and the fur is so fine that it isn't very noticeable on clothing and furniture. Baths are rarely necessary unless the cat is white or has a lot of white on the coat. Those cats can start to look dingy if they are not regularly bathed. The coat dries quickly after a bath. Brush their teeth to prevent periodontal disease. Daily dental hygiene is best, but weekly brushing is better than nothing. Wipe the corners of the eyes daily with a soft, damp cloth to remove any discharge. Use a separate area of the cloth for each eye so you don't run the risk of spreading any infection. Check the ears weekly. If their ears look dirty, wipe them out with a cotton ball or soft damp cloth moistened with a 50-50 to -50 mixture of cider vinegar and warm water. Avoid using cotton swabs, which can damage the interior of the ear. Keep their litter box spotlessly clean. Like all cats, Sphinx and Devon Rex are very particular about bathroom hygiene. Although the Sphinx feels warm to the touch, he doesn't have a fur coat to keep him warm. If you're cold, he probably is too. Buy him a nice sweater or two to help him retain heat. The Devon Rex feels warm to the touch, but he is always seeking warmth. If you are cold, he probably is too. Buy him a nice sweater or two to help him retain heat. It's a good idea to keep a Sphinx Devon Rex as an indoor-only cat to protect them from diseases spread by other cats, attacks by dogs or coyotes, and the other dangers that face cats who go outdoors, such as being hit by a car. Sphinx and Devon Rex who go outdoors also run the risk of being stolen by someone who would like to have such an unusual cat without paying for it. If possible, build your Sphinx and Devon Rex a large outdoor enclosure where they can jump and climb safely. If your Sphinx and Devon Rex have an outdoor enclosure that allows for sunbathing, be sure to apply cat safe sunscreen to their body to prevent sunburn. The active and social Sphinxes and Devon Rexes are a perfect choice for families with children and cat-friendly dogs. They learn tricks easily and love the attention they receive from children who treat them politely and with respect. They live peacefully with dogs and other cats. Always introduce pets slowly and in controlled circumstances to ensure that they learn to get along together. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.